The All Progressives Congress APC campaign counselor in Kogi Kosak has accused the People's Democratic Party PDP for hiring people from seven neighbouring states for its campaign rally on Saturday in Kogi. Kingsley Fangwo, the director of media and publicity Kosak, stated this at a press conference on Monday in Lokoja, tagged the many lies of PDP and its traditional illusions in Kogi state. Fangwo also said the PDP was dismayed by the poor turnout and resorted to theatrics of rolling out expired individuals who had been expunged from the ranks of the APC to their party. What they said would be an overflow rally that will bring our city to a standstill for the day barely registered on the radar of hardworking Kogites. The innocents who did turn out for them in vain, hope of hearing anything which might persuade them to reevaluate their poor opinion of the PDP, left reinforced in their disdain for people whose stint in government brought their state, nay country, to their knees. Even their diehard members who came in expectations of the usual largesse associated with the party in her hate days became dispirited when the lies started. The rest of our people went about their normal businesses utterly disinterested in the hollow antics of a party that once wasted 13 precious years for them. Dismayed by the poor turnout, the PDP resorted to theatrics. It rolled out expired individuals who had been expunged from the ranks of the APC for their unsavory deeds and characters and proceeded to canonize them. The rally turned into a farce when people like the former deputy governor of the state, Heather Simon Achuba, and the former speaker of the state assembly, Right Honorable Alpha Imam, were repackaged for Atiku as Kogi APC stalwarts who were decamping to the PDP at the rally. What Atiku and his entourage might not have known is that this is the same Achuba who was unceremoniously impeached from office with ignominy by the State Assembly for gross misconduct during the first term of the administration. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.